Oh, look at that. That's an interestingly hidden secret. It kind of annoys me because there's a lot of stuff that's just hanging out on top of the screen that usually you can just go on top anyways, but whatever. Let's just look at all these stars. Whoa. This feels like a DKC3 minigame. I also missed all the stars. Oh well. Why does this one give you so much time? Like, Jesus Christ. Why was that one minigame in the mine level so much harder than everything else I've done so far? Just because there was like no time. No time? Well, that was weird. <laughs> There we go. So what's this bonus gonna be like? Is this gonna be another easy one? Kinda. As long as I have these two, I can just do this. What was that? Why that barrel? Jeez, the sound effects are messed up for me. See, I'm gonna actually pause the backtracking here for a second. Uh, my emulator is like totally like, I don't even know why it does this. Like, the sound effects are, like, misplaced or something. Like, it's, it's, it, like, randomly plays, like, old sound effects that didn't play. That also wasn't the last bonus. Great. Did I find a coin? Nope. Uh... Yeah, like, did you hear that? I need to find coins and reset this game right now before it completely screws everything up. So, see you guys then. But carry them through. Like, I don't know how the level designer expected you to keep them all the way to the end. Also found the bonus. Like, everything that's off screen kills you, so, like, you can't do anything. Also, really? No! Oh, what? Well, at least I found a coin farm. <sighs> Oh, pl I pretty much jumped me off him as late as possible. That's really weird. Ugh. There we go. Perfect. So basically, it's designed that if you have Ratley, it's basically timed perfectly. That's cool. Is that it? No, what? <laughs> They're like, uh. See, okay, I'm back. Um. See, this is exactly why I've always been worried about trying to 100% this because I looked through both this level, Reptile Rise, and Blue Tail Trouble for like a good, like, while. I And I even resorted to once again looking up a guide because I was at, wasn't even sure if there was a bonus left to find, and sure enough, if there is a bonus to be found, then nobody's found it, because I looked up a guide, and even the guide didn't have any, like, video recordings of him getting the bonuses, so, for now, it's just gonna be, there's no, like, bonus to find there, so whatever, let's just pay Clubba, and do our first actual content, Native Spirits, let's do it, so what's this level gonna be like? Well, there's a dope. Oh, what the shit? Great. So there was a squitter there, but he was instantly gone. Nope. Oh, so apparently another case where you can't actually. Yeah, you can't actually, like. What? Whoa, look at him. Oh, so this just in mini neckies do not sound proper when. Whoa, wait, what? Oh, I was landing on this. All right, that's funky.
I'm not sure about this level already. Although, now that I'm noticing, that background looks really nice. I'm not sure if I've ever noticed that before. Like, look at that. Whoa. Oh, he's like climbing ropes. Well, like little vines. We can't even grab those. I feel like that's cheating. Mm. Alright, well, if Squitter gets you anything, he didn't get anything while I was there, so. Is there anything here? Oh, shoot, there is. Ratley, this. Ratley, the snake. Ah, what do I have him? Rah, 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 rah. Whoops! Whoa! He like glitched. And he's still, he's like persistent off screen. Whoa. Let me see something. I'm gonna go over here and now let's go back and see. He's still there. What the heck? We're like behind him and stuff. See, I know that the spikes are supposed to like, like the way the spikes work in this game, they're different from other damage sources. They're like one of the very few environmental damage sources that's like part of like a tile set. They're not like munchers, but like they like, as you can see there, they actually like permanently kill stuff. And that applies to a lot of enemies. Like you probably know from Clobber Carnage in the original game, that like when the clobbers jump on these spikes, they actually die. And that, that applies to a lot of other things, including your animal buddies. When they touch the spikes, they actually, they don't run away, they just straight up die. But, I guess, since Ratley's never supposed to touch them, nor... Actually, none of the other animal buddies ever get a chance to touch them, since you never just normally ride them either, but... I guess that's what happens. That's really weird. Is that guy gonna be glitched again? Yeah, he sure is. Well, everyone's glitched now. What? He like phased through it. Get out of my face, buddy. This level is really weird. Also, this is funky. I just, I just pointed. It took me a second to realize how. F fuck you. How funky this is. Ugh. Ugh. Get out of here, punk. I couldn't even see what he was! He was behind the foreground! I thought it was gonna be another one of the sword guys, so I wasn't I wasn't just gonna jump all willy-nilly. Oh, so that's a dirty move. That could have killed me. Yo. Alright, oh, there's nothing up here yet. Uh well, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Hey everyone, this is Monkey Dragon from Guys Who Play Games. Backwards some more, Donkey Country 2, the last levels. <laughs> oh god. Get out of here, punk. Yeah, I don't need that cutlass. Get out of here. You people, man. Wow, that is a case of hitbox of innocence. Although I'm not really sure if that's really the proper term. Actually, all things considered, I probably didn't touch him. It's just like, that's a really tiny platform to be able to jump on. I don't know why it's designed like that. I'm just gonna, oh my god. Into the pit. Uh, okay, let's just do everything proper and let's not do any side stuff for now because I just wanna get the heck out of this level. 
I did it. Ugh. Yeah, take that, punks. Take that, cutlass. Your name is based off the sword you carry, so you have no identity. Actually, I wonder if I could... Well, here's an easy way to fix this. Oh, what the... There. There we go. That deals with his crappy little hitbox. And I can grab this crate again, get an extra life, and throw it at this bee so he's not in the way. Except they didn't do it properly. Whatever. I don't know if I don't even need to be with the bottom of this barrel because I can just glide across. Ah! Ah! I see you! Whoa. Okay, so we need to be careful. Ah. Oh, there's a mini Naki up there. He's going off screen. So I know the mini Naki's kind of float back and forth, but that's like pretty extreme right there. Get out of here, punk. Don't even like make the sound effect, that's really weird. Why, what the heck am I looking at here? This is a really weird level. Like, uh, I don't know what to say. Also, I never found the freaking thing. You can't even see them play their guitar. Well, I beat the level, but I never found any bonuses, so I gotta go back. But at least I can start Slack now. So, uh, see you guys in just a bit. Why don't I officially the level? Wow. Aha! It's early on in the level. That's pretty interesting. Oh, pfft. For crying out loud. I don't need your pity game. Just go back in the bonus. See... I don't know. <laughs> I try to be all fancy and like spam these things and then it's just like this guy right behind me. Oh, that was a red one? That red one was probably like super fast. Yeah. That was always glitchy. <laughs> oh, I just got a Snapchat from good guy 009 otherwise known as Seth Crumbly. Let's see. What do you think? back. Well, now we're done with that fiasco. Uh, that's pretty much it for this part. Like, I beat everything. Actually, I do want to do one more thing. Hopefully, I don't manage to get myself killed along the way. Let's just... And now I gotta jump over this bonus. <gasps> Crap! The bonus is above... At the top of the level. Well... I guess this is another good opportunity to just check out... Okay, so we got green... Come on! I was holding up the whole time! It wouldn't shoot! For crying out loud. Fine, I'll just go under then. Whatever. Okay, what happens if I jump on this thing? He just falls to the screen. That seems more normal. Alright, well, anyways. That'll be all for this time. We've beaten all of the levels of World 2. 
and we'll be heading on to starting world three. So, see you guys then.